Hi everyone, let's solve question number 41. Corners are cut off from an equilateral triangle to produce a regular hexagon. Then the ratio of the area of hexagon and the triangle is. Now, let's say this is our triangle. So how, what kind of cuts should we make? We cannot make a cut like that because we know that internal angles of hexagon would uh, is actually 120 degree. And if I make a cut, off, cut like that, it would not be 120 degree. So it should always be parallel to the opposite side. So if I have to make cuts to make a regular hexagon, then these uh, cuts should be parallel to the opposite side. So this is how we have to make the cuts. So that is our first condition. Now, we know that in case of a regular hexagon, all sides are equal. So if this is A, this is A and this is A. And also we know that this angle, since these are like, these lines are parallel. So this is 60 degree, this is 60 degree, and this is also 60 degree because this actual triangle was equal to triangle. And if this line is parallel to this line, so these and these should be 60 and this is also already 60. So this should also be equal to triangle. So basically this should also be A and this should also be A. So basically we got to know that we have divided the entire side into three equal parts. So A, A and A. So the entire length of the side would be 3A. So we have to find out the ratio of the area of hexagon and the triangle. So for hexagon, what, what we can do, we can take the entire area and subtract the three areas of these triangles. So that would give me root three by four, three A square. That is the total area of triangle minus root three by four, four A square multiplied by three, right? So this should be the area of hexagon divided by the total area of triangle. That is root three by four, 3a whole square. So root 3 by root 3 by 4, root 3 by 4, root 3 by 4 get cancelled. And also a square is also cancelled. So we are left with 9 minus 3 divided by 9. So that is 6 by 9, that is 2 by 3. So b is the correct answer.